Okay, next we have biometrics. And biometrics, as you're familiar with more than likely, is authentication based upon who you are and something that you have, okay? Whether that be a fingerprint, an iris or a retina scan, a voice print, it typically ties into an access control system, which grants permissions, rights, or access once authenticated. All right, so we've seen these in a, in a variety of shapes and sizes. They can be a, a single fingerprint reader. It can it can read a thumbprint, a fingerprint, or a whole handprint. Uh, there are also some biometrics that, like I said, can do retina scans or iris scans. They can do voice recognition. Okay, things along these lines. So it really just depends upon the nature of the system, and the, it offers an additional layer of security because it's not just something that you know. In other words, you can't tell somebody else your PIN or your password and they go use it. It has to. It actually has something that you are, whether it be, like I say, a fingerprint, voice print, iris, and so on and so forth. <laughs> right. So unless, unless you know, you chop off your finger or somebody takes an eyeball out, you're not going to be able to bypass that specific uh, security control.